guys. Jay Don's back out with another one. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you comment. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. We post every single week. Um, but I wanted to, I just wanted to jump into something real quick. So Deshaun Watson, Deshaun Watson, you might you might know him. He's he's, he's a generational talent. You might know him. Uh, quarterback from the Houston Texans. Uh, reports have came out that it seems like he's played his last snap as a Houston Texan in 2020. That's that was probably it for Deshaun Watson. Deshaun Watson has had a you know, boil over with him. He's not happy. He's angry. He wants out of Houston. And I want all my Giants fans, come here. Just come here real quick. It's not going to happen. It will not happen. It will not happen, guys. Now, if you ask me, because I know someone's going to ask me, if, would you trade Daniel Jones and two first-round picks for Deshaun Watson? I would. I would. But I'm not the general manager. You're not the general manager. We're not the general manager of the Giants. Dave Gettleman is. Dave Gettleman's the general manager. And you know who Dave Gettleman took with the sixth overall pick in the 2019 draft? His quarterback, Daniel Jones. And Daniel Jones has confidence. He is confident in Daniel Jones. Joe Judge is confident. John Mara is confident in Daniel Jones. So he's going to be the quarterback in 2020. So people who want De Deshaun Watson to become a giant, it will not happen. It shouldn't happen. If you look at what we're going to have to trade for Deshaun Watson, point blank, period, it's going to be DJ. You're going to have to trade like three to two first-round picks. Three first-round picks to be exact. That's what you have to give the Houston Texans for Deshaun Watson. You put Deshaun Watson on this team right now. Is this team a bona fide, certified playoff contender? It's not. It's not. The Giants' offense is not better than the Houston Texans' offense. They don't have a Will Fuller, who's one of the best deep jets in the league. Brandon Cooks, who's a, who was a 1,000-yard receiver last year. And Deshaun Watson is still unhappy. With, if you put him on this team, what do you think it's going to be then? He has a no-trade clause. He's going to hold up a lot of cap space. Not saying he's not worth it. He's worth it, but, you know, he's going to hold up a lot of cap space. He has no-trade clause. If a team like the Bears or a team like the 49ers, teams that are going to be in the playoffs if they get him, if they have a chance to go out and get him, and Deshaun Watson wants to go to a 49ers team, which team is he picking? The Giants, the team that was just 6-10. and 10. And I'm not trying to bash my Giants, but I'm just calling it how it is. A team that was just 6-10, and 10, or a team that a couple years ago was just in the Super Bowl. You drop Deshaun Watson on that 49ers team, that team is a favorite to win the Super Bowl. You drop Deshaun Watson on the Bears, that team is going to have a deep playoff run if they keep their pieces intact. You put Deshaun Watson on the Giants... We are, we might make the playoffs, might, you know, so I want everyone to just calm down. The Giants are building this team the way they're supposed to build it, and that's through the draft, and they're picking up a few pieces of free agency to fill holes, and they're going to just keep doing that. We need to hope for progression. We need to believe in Daniel Jones. I'm a believer in Daniel Jones. I think when we get Daniel Jones, Daniel Jones, a, you know, some more weapons, I think he could be a great quarterback, and that's what I think he's going to be this year. So everyone... Calm down on Deshaun Watson. It's not going to happen. Dave Gettleman is a believer in Daniel Jones. He drafted Daniel Jones. That's a hill he's going to die on. Well, he that's a hill that DJ doesn't work out. That's a hill that he's worthily dying on. He's going to be able to die on that. And, you know, I like Deshaun Watson, man, but he shouldn't be a giant. It will not happen, guys. Uh, the Giants need to keep building how they're building through the draft, picking up a little piece of free agency. I like the way they're doing it. Just got to hope for progression from all our players. Um, so yeah, that's what it'll do for me, man. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, leave your comments, leave your thoughts on it. Um, send this to me, boy, Jay Dines. I am out. Go Giants.